So today's video is about how to create equations in uh, Word or in PowerPoint. This could also work as well. This is what I generally do in practice um, on a day-to-day -day basis as I make quizzes and tests. Um, I use a tool uh, that's not the insert equation that comes up here. Where is it? Uh, insert equation. It's not even uh, an option. It's uh, blanked out right now. Uh, what I do is uh, I go to insert an object and uh, before I migrated to a Mac on my old laptop, I used to have an option here that said Microsoft Equation Editor 3.0 or some version like that. Um, my guess is that you probably have that on Word uh, already installed. Um, so if you have that, use that. Uh, when I switched over to a Mac, I didn't have that any longer, but uh, I downloaded a program called MathType, and it works uh, basically the same. It looks very similar, um, and so uh, that's the option I'm going to show you. Uh, MathType 6.0, uh, I'll hit OK, and after uh, thinking about it for a second, or two, or ten, there we go. Um, a little box like this popped up and uh, near the top you see a bunch of different templates and uh, um, you'll probably spend most of the time uh, working here. Uh, this has got your fraction bar or your radical bar, squares and cubed roots and all that sort of stuff. And so if I wanted to create an equation, um, maybe I'll have a square root of x plus 5. Oops plus 5 um, over x minus 2 plus 3x um, squared um, stuff. If I wanted 3x squared, this option uh, is your superscript. Notice at the bottom, um, I can't show you at the same time, but uh, it says uh, that you can uh, do a keyboard shortcut. For me, that's uh, Command E um, on the old uh, on the old, for me old, on my uh, laptop before, which is a PC-based, Windows-based program, um, that was uh, Control-H for high and Control-L for low, uh, was a keyboard shortcut that I had memorized. But uh, um, anyway, if I do that, it gives you a little box for um, an exponent. Pressing over uh, or clicking somewhere gets you out of that box. Um, and equals, uh, or if you have some strange symbols like less than or equal to, all those are here. Uh, if you have um, uh, Greek letters, um, for physics I often have deltas and thetas, uh, the pi symbols. Uh, all the Greek letters are here. Um, capital versions of them are there. Um, Strange symbols like uh, infinity uh, are located here. Um, eventually in pre-calc we'll do things with matrices. So there's a matrix uh, template that's here uh, that you can use. Um, arrow keys like for geometry. Uh, you might have arrows on top of things, vectors, line segments, rays. Uh, there's a, just a lot of options here. So uh, that's math type. Um, if I finish this equation and uh, when I'm done, I'll close this. Uh, I think escape might work as well. And uh, you'll notice that it's uh, a little box here. Uh, it's an object in Word. It acts very similar to a picture, so you can uh, expand it, uh, make it bigger, smaller. Um, you might be able to crop it. You might be able to change um, background colors and things like that if you're interested. Um, this object, you can center. Um, you can have it uh, be in the middle of a line, so the equation um, blah 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 uh, is a example of a rational and radical equation. And uh, it just moves around with you. Uh, you can edit this. Uh, if I realize I made a mistake, uh, I can double click on it and it comes back up and I can make changes. Um, pretty simply and so forth too. Um, if I know that I have a similar equation, um, copy in and paste is good. So I just uh, hit uh, Command C and Command V to paste it. And then this one I can make a slight change. Maybe uh, this one's less than instead. 
or uh, I did some simplifications. That's how. That's what I normally do when I write a quiz or a test or a worksheet. That's the tool that I default to. Um, it's a good day-to-day -day tool um, that uh, you probably have an insert object. I bet somewhere in there you have an equation item of some sorts. So I hope that helps, and uh, let me know if you have any questions.